Hi, if you want to use spreadsheets on Casio, you can go to the menu and click on 8. Then you can see spreadsheets on Casio scientific calculator. Your calculator has 45 rows and A to E columns. If you want to add values to spreadsheets, you can type the values using keyboard and press on equal button. For example, I want to add 15 here. I just type 15 using keyboards and press on equal button. You can use the arrows to move between rows and columns. Here 20, I go to shell and type 20 and press equal button. Let's check how delete values inside shells. You can press on option, then go to tree, then you can delete contain inside the shell. Now I am going to uh, fill the shells using values. If I use the Excel, I can drag the shell in my calculators. I click on option and go to to fill values then I can add the value I want to fill I press on 10 then equal button then I can set the range I can use arrows to go between shell address here I can type 4 ok click on equal button then I apply the values I want to fill shells using 10 like this I go to the calculators and click, click on option then to field values then I can type the value here 10 then I am going to set the range I use the arrows to edit the shell address ok A1 so I want to add D1 here for the type in D I can click on alpha and Scene button you can see then click on equal now I am going to add a1 shell and a2 shell using excel equal sum and data range sum here and data range I can type the data range ok enter now I am going to use the calculator, click on option button, then down arrow, find the sum for, click on, if you want to use other function you can max mean, mean function you can use, I want to use sum, just press on 4, ok. Now I want to add the shell address, click on 2, grab and go to the cell address press the equal button ok a1 ok now I want to add semicolon for that uh, I can press on alpha button press on alpha and this button ok this is the uh, semicolon then click on option and click on 2 grab the shell address and go to the shell address and press the equal button ok then put the close button and equal 
let's check how to find maximum value for excel i can use the max function to find maximum value okay i find this i use this calculator and click on option button then find the max and click on 2 here press the 2 then I want to add shell range for that I click on option then click on 2 grab the shell address ok and I want to add a1 and click equal then I want to add semicolon then option and grab then I want to add B1 go to the B1 shell and press equal button then I want to put bracket I am going to fill the cell with the formula sum I am going to fill the sum for formula and drag the shell in here click on option button then click on 2 sorry uh, click on 1 and I want to put the formula here click on option and find the sum 4 then I can put the cell range ok I click on option and grab the shell address go to the a1 and select and equal then I want to put colon alpha and colon button then click on option go to the 2 grab I want to grab the b1 equal ok close the bracket and I want to add the range to fill with formula go to uh, use the arrows and delete and grab option grab and select the c3 and equal ok I fill with the formula if I change the cell values formula will be updated here we just uh, talk how to add dollar sign to a uh, formula I want to uh, multiply by each cells from 14 so I click a1 and multiply by 14 and I put the dollar signs before and after in this letter now I am going to use the calculator for do this copy the formula ok let's uh, check the calculator click on option button and uh, one fill the formula and I want to type the formula here I click on option button and first grab the shell address for a1 and select the a1 then the multiply signs and click on option and I want to add one for dollar signs then I want to grab shell address okay now I want to put the dollar sign after B option and click on 1 okay finish for then uh, I want to add the range okay C1 then I want to change this delete option to grab 
and set the shared address okay click equal button okay finish let's share your spreadsheet with a classpad.net you can click on shift button and option then you can see barcode then you can scan this barcode and use this uh, link to open classpad.net with your spreadsheets if you have any problems uh, about this video you can comment below please subscribe my channel for next video thank you very much for watching this video